students welcome you all on the behalf of rahul anand tutorial so i do know that i am rahul anand and this is somewhat around my channel whose name is actually the rahul anand tutorial so now let's begin with the very interesting topics which are often being asked in terms of your need of in the aims of in the all india pre medical examination so these are literally belonging from which of the chapters of your book so these are belonging from the neural control and coordination case so today here we are going to study about what here we are going to study about the neuron now let's understand about this means what are actually the neuron so neuron are what so neuron are actually the tiny structure often the nerve cells structural and functional unit is known as what so often your nerve cell structural and functional unit these are known as the neuron so what are actually these means the structural and functional unit we will be understanding about it later now often when we are talking about the particular structure of the neuron so it will be resembling the structure which will be particularly viewed in term of what in term of only by the help of the microscope so these are particularly known as what so these are known as to be having the here mean the microscopic body as well when we are talking about these means what are actually the neuron parts so these will be particularly divided into the three broad categories so these are actually what so these are the cyto then the dendrite then what then the axon now let's understand about this means what are actually the cyton so cyton will be having what what things so in the cyton you will be having the here mean the cytoplasm with reference it will be often having the here mean the cell organelles as well as what as well as the defined nucleus so when we are talking about what are actually the cytoplasm so you are very clear what are actually the cytoplasm we are having the cell in these we will be having what the species and in term with the coordinates of the internal structure of those of those species so these are actually known as what so these are nothing else but known as the here with the cytoplasm <clears throat> often when we are talking about the cell organelles you are very clear about that so it will be actually what the components which are literally being present in term of what in term of your cell region such as what so we are having the nucleus of course in term we are often having what what things the golgi complex the golgi apparatus of in the endoplasmic reticulum in term of the two broad categories such as the rough endoplasmic reticulum the smooth endoplasmic reticulum <clears throat> often you will be having the another th things such as what such as the lysosomes of in the ribosomes in term of the two broad categories so these are actually what so these are the 70s ribosomes of in the 80s ribosomes so you understood about what are actually the cell organelles the components or rather the parts literally being project in term of what in term of actually your cell trees as well as nucleus <clears throat> so very clearly knowing so these will be containing the genetic material and what are genetic material very clearly knowing as well as as well as when we are talking about this means what are actually the presents with reference to your cytoplasm so cytoplasm are what the components <clears throat> or other the species literally present in term of your cell so it will be present in term of part of the cells in both the animal cells as well as the plant cells so with reference with the with the what with actually your cytoplasm it will be having the nasal granules as well as when we are talking about these which what are actually the nasal granules role playing important role for what for releasing as well as synthesizing of what of the proteins so you remember when we are talking about the synthesis of the proteins so these are actually being divided in terms of the broad categories such as what such as the translation of in the transcription so what are actually this transcription the overall process of formation of what the mrna from what from the deoxyribose nucleic acid by what mode actually by the help of the transmittable amount often what often the here we are having what we are having the actually catalyst so these are actually what so these are the tell me so these are actually the rna polymerase so you are remembering as well as understanding about what are actually the pcr mean the polymerase chain reaction likewise the process will be repeated on the other hand you are often having the translation so what are actually the role of the translation tell me the whole wonderful process of the formation of what the whole wonderful process of the formation of the mrna from the dna actually coming under from what case so this will be coming under the translation case so now let's understand about this <clears throat> so you understand about this what are actually the role of the nasal granules play important role in terms of what in terms of the protein synthesis case as well as the protein releasing case so you could often find here with reference to the diagram find here <clears throat> the cytone so these are often present here find here <clears throat> the cytone or either the cell body 
So you could often clearly understand that cytone as well as these means what the cell body are generally being present as well as <coughs> are generally quite similar in nature. Thus, we are often calling the cytone with reference to what with reference to the help of the cell body or as well. Now let's understand about these means what are actually the dendrite. So in this case, what will be happening from the cytone as well as the cell body? The nucleus of the thread-like structure will be arising, and these are actually known as what? So these are actually known as the dendrite case. Often your nasals, granules, composition are directly proportional for what? Are directly proportional as well as known as the dendrite case. And you know about the role of these nasal, nasals, granules. So the role of these nasals, granules are actually what? So this play an important role in terms for synthesizing of the proteins as well as what? As well as releasing of the protein. So you know about the protein very well. So proteins are what? So protein are the macro molecules of the amino acid. And amino acid will be what? Just reverse the concept means what it will be the tiny structure or either the polymer of what of actually your protein often they being divided into the four broad categories such as what such as the primary structure the secondary structure the tertiary structure the quadratory structure each of these are particularly having the specialized function as well as each of these are having the specialized role means in term of what in term of your protein now so let's understand about the dendrite once again so in this case finally what will be happening so your dendrites are particularly receiving the impulses from what? So <clears throat> your dendrites are particularly receiving the impulses from the external or either the outer side as well as transmitting it towards what side as well as transmitting the impulses towards the here mean the cell body side. Now so let's understand about this mean the third. So we'll, we have dealt about actually what? So we have dealt about this <clears throat> mean the cyto then what then the dendrite. Now so let's understand about this means what are actually the Exons. So the exons are actually what? As well, when we are talking about these means what are actually the exons. So exons are what? So exons are the elongated fibers. Generally, developed from what is? So it will be developed from the cell body region as well as the cytone region. So you could often find here on the board. So what are actually the cytone as well as the cell body? Find here. Yeah, here you could often find here. <clears throat> so these are literally particularly what? The envelope are literally known as what? So these are known as the cell body as well as the cytone case. Now, as well, when we are talking about this, this what are actually the exon endings. So exon endings are what? So exon is having the fibrous endings. So these are literally known as what? So these fibrous endings are actually known as the exon endings. So you could often popularly find here on the board here. <coughs> the exon ending as well as the nerve ending. Now, so after that you are having the synaptic nerve. So what are actually the Synaptic. After that, after that, we are having the synaptic nerve. So, what are actually the synaptic nerve? Tell me. So, from each of the exons, we will be having what? So, from each of the exons, there are the bulb-like structure which are literally being arising. So, these are known as what? So, these are known as nothing else but known as the synaptic nerve. So, you could often popularly find here on the board here. As well, as well, when we are talking about what? The synaptic nerve. So, your synaptic nerve will be having what things? So your synaptic knob will be actually having the synaptic vesicles with what? With the neurotransmitter. So you are often very clear about what the what are actually the role of the neurotransmitter. Remember? So you are having the symptoms such as the babies. And it what happens? In which your <coughs> neurotransmitter junction are literally being disturbed. In term, what will be happening? So we will be having the jolotal like symptoms. So you are often clear about what are actually the jolot like symptoms. In this case, the perfect ratio with reference to what? With reference to your isotropic value as well as the anisotropic value in terms of the light band as well as the here mean the heavy bands are literally being disturbed so these are actually coming under from what case so this will be coming under from the locomotion and movement case with reference to what with reference to the movement of the muscles now so you understand what actually the neuromotor <coughs> role so with reference by these we will be having the different types of the stimuli cross bones playing an important role often in terms of what? In terms of regulating the motor junction such as you are having the case of the rabies. In terms we could find that the symptoms or either the rabies viruses are literally playing an important role to cause what? To cause the jollof like symptoms. <clears throat> so this is somewhat when we are comparing the case. So what are actually these? Means what? So, so this is somewhat the case when we are talking about the neurons. So these are particularly the tiny structure. Often we have understood about the different parts, such as what, such as the 
<coughs> cytone, often known as the cell body. Then what? Then the dendrite. As well as what are actually the egg germs. So I thought you have got the concept of what are actually these. So you could often write these. So if you like the work with reference to the education, often the lectures as well as the videos. So you could often subscribe, like, as well as comment below in the text. Thus I will be knowing that what concept actually you are hungry for or what haven't you understood or either got. So you could often write this. So if you like the work with reference to the education, please like, subscribe as well as share with reference to what? With reference to the Dahulanan tutorials. So very thank you.